All right, it is officially the beginning of election season, friends, because early voting starts today. That means county clerks all across our state are going to be sending out any of those ballots, the mail-in ballots that you had requested. And we've seen the heated race for governor playing out through attack ads coming from both sides. But does the constant barrage of campaign ads encourage or discourage voters? Spencer Schott spoke to the Secretary of State's office today. Spencer, what could this highly contested election mean for voter turnout? Well, Julie, even though it is a midterm election this year, the Secretary of State's office is optimistic that the turnout will be high, especially after looking back at, last, at the last midterm election. During the last midterm election in 2018, New Mexico saw a surprising 55% voter turnout. Which is actually pretty good, pretty high uh, for uh, for a, a midterm general election. But this year, even more is on the ballot. Given the other... Uh, factors at play, the fact that we have a high profile governor's race, uh, the you know recent Supreme Court rulings, you know things of that nature, you know it uh, we would expect the turnout to be similar to 2018 and wouldn't be surprised if it even got upwards uh, of 60 percent. We normally see bigger turnouts for presidential elections, but this year the governor's race is taking center stage and the campaign attack ads have been coming down from both sides for a while now. Is that encouraging people to get to the polls or is that kind of deterring people? They just want this all to get over. But I think one of the good things about the campaign ads and, and you know, all the mailers that we all get and that, that kind of thing is that it really does uh, make people aware of, of the, that there's an election going on. The only thing about these ads that worry the Secretary of State's office is some could contain misinformation. One thing that we are kind of, uh, that election administrators, the Secretary of State's office and county clerks are concerned about is the kind of the rise of misinformation about elections and about that misinformation keeping people home, keeping people away from uh, wanting to vote because they may have uh, kind of lost faith in, uh, in our election system. So they've put together a website that addresses voter concerns and fact checks rumors surrounding our elections. People should have plenty of confidence in their elections. Uh, we have very accurate, well-run elections in New Mexico where everyone's vote counts no matter how you choose to cast a ballot. Plus, if you have any other questions related to the upcoming election, like where to vote, requesting an absentee ballot, or if you just want to see who's on the ballot, we have a link to their website on KOB.com.